Hey y'all, hey, it's Amir Renee. Welcome to my channel. And today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of this bag that I was so excited that I finally got my hands on. Just came in the mail today. I'm so excited to show you guys. It's the Telfar bag. I've been looking for this bag for the last two months and I came across a couple YouTubers pages talking about how hard it is to get this bag. So I watched a couple videos and basically the bag sell out in minutes. So if you want to grab a bag, you have to go to the Telfar website and sign up to be put on notification when they have new merchandise that drop or you can follow them on Instagram. And I got a couple notifications for different bags, different colors and sizes that I didn't want. I really wanted uh, the chocolate one and a black one, but this tan one became available. So I set my alarm for 8.50 make sure I had their page open and to the actual bag that I wanted. Nine o'clock on the dot, I refreshed the page and it became available. I put it in my cart and I hurried up and paid with um, PayPal. Also, I was seeing that people said like, instead of putting in your, I guess like you wanna pay with a credit card, putting your credit card information in, you should pay with PayPal or Apple Pay because while you're typing your information in and you go ahead and hit accept, the bag could be gone that fast. Anyway, so that happened Thursday. So I paid for the bag Thursday, and here it is Saturday. It came really fast, so I'm so excited to show you guys. It came in this dust bag. And also, why I'm so excited about this brand, for those of you who don't know, Telflar is created by a black person, black owned brand, a black guy, and the T and the C is his initials. His name is Telflar Clemens. So I thought that was really cute too. Do you see how cute this is? So freaking cute. I love the logo. It's simple, but yet it's unique. And in the inside, it just has the logo again on the inside. Pretty small, no pockets or anything, and just a snack to close which I'm quite sure this is going to be filled to the top that I'm not even going to be able to close it. I don't know if you could tell, but this baby is teeny. When I opened it, I was like, okay, <laughs> this is the smallest bag I've I owned so far, but I still really like it. So, so cute. It's vegan leather. And it's affordable. The small, which is the one I have, is a hundred and fifty dollars, I'm gonna say. Yeah, a hundred and fifty. But no taxes. And I just wanted to show you guys what I could fit inside this purse. So I have a huge wallet. I already knew my wallet was not gonna fit in here. But let me show you. I think this is the cutest thing. A couple years ago I went to a natural hair convention and I purchased this little set. It's like a I guess you could carry like a little handbag. And it came with a little wallet and then a little change pouch right here. And I never wore it. I thought it was just so cute. And I don't know, I just didn't have a, the right time to wear it. I don't know. But I realized, oh, this is small enough that I could put my, my bank cards or any cards in and carry it in my bag. And then the little change part. I usually don't even carry change around with me, but just in case I do. So I'm going to put that in there. Keys. I have my car keys, my house keys with some mace. I gotta stay protected at all times. Just speaking of being protected, I have my little pocket situation here. Hand sanitizer, breath mints. You know we have to wear masks now, so breath might get a little tart. So go ahead and. Pop your cup of breath mints when you need to or give them to someone. Alcohol wipes. Might need to wipe your phone off. What else do I carry? Oh yeah, I carry chapstick, a couple chapsticks. You know, I want my lips to be dry. And then also I carry some Vaseline. Some pills. Never know, you might get a headache, stomach ache. And I think that might, oh. Of course, you need your phone, and then my phone. So that's everything. That's why I knew y'all probably wouldn't be able to snap it close, but that's fine. So now everything fits in here perfectly, and I actually have more room. 
So everything fits in here perfectly. And I'm gonna show you how long it is against me, I guess. Let me see. So I'm 5'8", and it hits me right here. And if I cross body it, with no coat on, so I definitely wouldn't cross body it with a coat on. It would probably be all the way up here, but if I cross body it in the summertime, mm, I really love this bag. I'm so excited. <laughs> I want to get the medium black one next. So I'll be on my search to find the medium black one and wait till it becomes available online. After recording the first video, I went online that same night and the black in all sizes was available for sale the next day. So I grabbed it. This is the medium Telfar shopping bag and black. This baby right here has everything I thought it was going to be. It's not too big, it's not too small. I was afraid it was gonna to be too big. It looked kind of big to me online, but it's the right size. And let me show you compared to the small, the small and the medium. I think the camera, I mean, it is a big difference, but the camera make this appear to be bigger than it is. Also the same with this one, the medium size. This small is really, really teeny. And the medium is not too big. So I am happy with my purchases. So with this one, let me show you what I have in here. Okay, I didn't really put anything in here yet. I just wanted to see. So this is my purse insert for my Neverfull. So I just took it out my Neverfull and put it in here and it fit perfectly. I think with the medium, I'm going to carry it with the long straps tucked away. And with the medium bag, you do have a pouch, like a zipper compartment. Zipper compartment. And it does have the logo again. And what I just found out, let me come closer. On both bags, the small and the medium, the logo inside the purse, it's like a little extra compartment. You can open it and put something in here. I don't know what you want to put in there, but that's cute. A little pocket. The medium shopping bag was $102. So I think I'm done with the bags now. <laughs> they are so cute. I love them, both of them. But these bags are so cute. If you were undecided, if you want to grab you one of these bags, I would say get them. They are so cute. Um, I love that it's the bags are created by a black person. Love supporting my people. I said that in 2021, I was going to try to go out my way to make sure I purchase from black owned businesses more often. They have a whole lot of fun colors. They have metallic colors, pink, blue, yellow, orange. So that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, comments, leave them down below. Do you have a Telfar bag? Do you love it as much as I love this? I haven't even worn it outside yet and I know I'm going to love this bag. Oh, well, thank you for watching as always. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.